what's up everyone it's your girl Faye I'm back again kama kawaida to me as always uh, so I'm here with a song by Harry Chapin that is uh, 30,000 pounds of uh, banana and uh, this is a live recording or rather live lyrics video recording I'm uh, excited and looking forward to listening to it uh, it's a lengthy one but uh, the description got me uh, eager to listen to it so let me just read what uh, the description for this song reads uh so here it goes uh harry chapin was one of the best storytelling songwriters uh this performance is a live recording and uh, harry keeps the audience very entertained and engaged uh throughout this uh, lengthy song I love entertainment, so I'm curious to listen to it and uh, yeah, come along with me. Uh, see you guys at the end for my comments as well as uh, interpretation. So join me, uh, come along. <laughs> Okay. okay, now there's only ah, one other wow. last requirement, and that is we'd like to get the uh, the L.A. Memorial Choir in on this one. Uh, are you guys, I guess you're game, you've been game all night, okay? I'm game. Uh, it's, a, it's a low part, but it builds up. Last, and all, last statement is that uh, this song starts out with an absolutely brilliant Chet Atkins guitar lick that it took me about four hours to steal, and I wish you'd appreciate Ooh. it when it comes by. It was just after dark when the truck started down The hill it leads into Scranton, Pennsylvania Carrying 30,000 pounds Of banana hey. Carrying 30,000 pounds Hitting Big John With it of banana A young driver just out on his second job, and he was carrying the next day's paste of fruit for everyone in that cold start city where children play without despair and backyard slack piles and folks manage to eat each day just about 30,000 pounds of bananas. Banana. <laughs> I love his voice. Bananas. Let's hear that again. Yes, there were 30,000 pounds. Screaming again, John. Oh, banana. Should have seen saying shift the low gear a fifty dollar fine, my friend. He was thinking perhaps about the warm breath woman who was waiting at the journey's end. He started down the two mile drop, the curving road that wound from the top of the hill. He was pushing on through the shortening miles that ran down to the depot, just a few more miles.
involvement. I love that. Uh, quite an entertainer for sure. So I hope you're loving it. Uh, you know, I come from uh, Banana Land. So I'm uh, feeling quite at home. Huh? <laughs> a little bit back. I'm coming up 30,000 pounds. Weave it now! Banana. Yes, there were 30,000 pounds. Even That led into the sneakers gray And he missed the thankful passing bus at 90 miles an hour And he said, go make it a dream As he rolled his last ride down He said, go make it a dream As he rolled his last ride down And he sounds quite like the need for cars Flipped all 13 telephone poles Hit two hours and blue big trees Across seven people, but then he lost his head. Not to mention an arm or two before he stopped. Stopped. And he smeared for 400 yards along the hill that leads into Scranton, Pennsylvania. All those 30,000 pounds. You guessed it. Banana. Thank God you're here. Now, some of you may think that it would be easy to write a song like this, but it isn't. See, most great works of art have a theme that holds them together. This song doesn't. As a matter of fact, I had a great deal of trouble ending it. As a matter of fact, the first ending was like this. Yes, we have no bananas We have no bananas today And if that wasn't enough Yes, we have no bananas Bananas in Scranton, PA Now, I was very proud of that ending. And with much anticipation, I sang, sang it for the guys in the group and my brothers. And the reaction was best summed up by my brother Tom, who said, Harry, it sucks. Well, I was devastated. But I went back to my lonely writer's garret and decided that I would try again and come up with a new ending. Since it was a country and western song, maybe I could write a country, country ending. Something about motherhood this time, because the song already had a truck. Okay. Something with weeping steel guitars, wailing fiddles, and an incredible banjo part. And something with harmony sung by, you guessed it, the L.A. Memorial Choir. You'll see your part when it comes by. A woman walks into her room where her child lies sleeping, sleeping And when she sees his eyes are closed She sits there silently weeping, weeping. I see gay liberation has hit L.A. <laughs> and though she lives in Scranton, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. 3,000 munchkins and a troll. <laughs> she never, ever eats banana. Not one of 30,000. 
thousand pounds. How many now? Half a million pounds. Sounds like the Mormon tubercular choir out there. I did well, get the, the sad joke. Truth is I missed the joke on uh, that part, elaborator. So anyway, I hope you are loving the song. Uh, so let's continue. Well, the sad truth is, no matter how loudly and how lovely, if that's a word, <laughs> you say of bananas, it doesn't alter in the least the fact that when I sang that ending for my brothers and the guys in the group, their reaction was best summed up by my brother Steve, who said, you got to be kidding me. What? You really expect that to end this song? I mean, it's nice, Harry. I mean, the words are potentially harmless. The, the music is a lot, it's, it's, it's pleasant. But uh, I think Tom's definitely right. It sucks. I was brokenhearted. And once more, I went back to my my writer's room and decided finally that honesty was the best policy and I would end the song the way I found out about it in the first place and that was coming on a Greyhound bus through Scranton, Pennsylvania in 1965 <laughs> like this You see, the man that told me about it on the bus says it went up the hill at a Scranton, Pennsylvania. You know, he shrugged his head, he shrugged his shoulders, and said, and this is exactly what he said. He said, Boy, <laughs> boy, <laughs> it sure must have been something. Just imagine 30,000 pounds of banana. <laughs> yes, there were 30. I love the excitement in uh, his voice, uh, this part. Uh, so let's hear that again. So oh, deep. <laughs> Boy. Boy. <laughs> it sure must have been something. Just imagine 30. Down pound of banana. <laughs> yes, there were thirty thousand pounds of mashed banana. A banana. A banana. Thirty thousand pounds of banana. sure was uh, interesting and uh, engaging uh, so I'm hoping you also felt uh, entertained uh, he's quite a storyteller for sure uh, so just writing a song about uh, this 30,000 bananas are uh, interesting uh, so yeah that is uh, 30,000 pounds of uh, bananas by Harry Chapin uh, so if you loved it you know what to do some love and uh, then drop a comment and share your thoughts on it and uh, of course anything else this is one of those songs that i feel like no need for an interpretation or anything so it's just a fun song i would say uh, about uh, this uh, 30,000 pounds of uh, bananas that end up being mashed bananas uh. so anyway uh, that's it for today uh, this episode is sponsored by uncle daniel so uncle daniel thank you so much for sharing this uh, with us uh, so uh, before i go if you're new here don't forget to subscribe for more and also suggest other songs by harry chapin that you think i might enjoy i love stories uh, so keep them coming and uh, i'll get to them uh, also, if uh, you'd love to be notified, remember to turn your notification bell on so that uh, 
you don't miss out on any episode if you'd love to support this channel kindly check the description below for details and uh for now your lovely lady is out so peace out and uh bye